Hello friends, welcome to Pioneer of Success, an online free educational institute. So we are continuing with the WBCS series and today we will be discussing on an important topic of WBCS 2018. So there is a good news for all the aspirants of WBCS 2018, the people who are going to appear for WBCS 2018 preliminary examination, they can actually make their preparation better by this methodology. So you have an option to prepare for WBS 2018 in a better way. So before going into details of the discussion, let me tell you something about myself. I am Shishudu Mitro, a research scholar of Indian Institute of Technology, Guwahati. I have interest in civil service preparation, so I upload videos on civil service preparation. And those are my email IDs. If you have any queries, you can anytime write me email. So this is the Gmail ID. You can write me in Gmail. So now let me show you something. So this is the website of West Bengal Public Service Commission. So I go to the official website. Yeah, this is the website of West Bengal Public Service Commission. Public Service Commission West Bengal, all of you know. So there is a recruitment notice, there is special recruitment, I will show you. Yeah, this is the notification, Public Service Commission West Bengal, advertise number 17-2017, 17 2017. This is the advertisement number. So this is a special recruitment examination for the post of assistant program officer 2017 now what is assistant program officer WBPSC has mentioned here properly so you can see here this is this is the recruitment for panchayat and rural development department government of West Bengal so there there are some requirements that's why this notification has been issued so that is not our concern. Our concern is you look at the syllabus of this examination. Let me download this just a minute. Yeah. So this is the notification. Now let me go to the syllabus of this examination. So, okay, uh, before going into the syllabus, let me tell you uh, the there will be two examination of this notification. Two examination means examination will be held in two parts. One is preliminary and other is main examination. The preliminary examination will be held in those centers: Kolkata, Bordawan, Midnapur, Malda, and Shilihu. So the people who are from North Bengal, they have only one center, Shiliguri. In South, you have Kolkata, Bordhavan, Medinipur, all the options, and uh, Malda in the middle of West Bengal. So, there are vacancies, and that is also given here. So you can see there are total 50 vacancies out of that unreserved 23 sc 11 st3 obc 6 physically handicapped 2 so total 50 vacancies so this is a good number of vacancy you can opt for this examination pay scale is also moderately good you have 7100 to 30 7600 pay scale with a great pay of 3900 okay now i go to the syllabus of this examination so if you scroll down here you can see okay qualification you know qualification is simple if you are graduate then you can appear for this examination yeah yeah this is the scheme and syllabus of this examination special recruitment examination for the post of assistant program officer 2017 scheme and syllabus so scheme is you have two examinations 
first one preliminary examination objective type final one final examination or main examination conventional type and then you have personality test so all these steps you have to overcome in order to get the appointment okay so now i tell you the syllabus of the examination if you can see here the preliminary syllabus the examination will consist of only one paper containing multiple choice objective type questions on general studies 150 marks now what is general studies in general study you have history you have geography you have indian polity you have current affairs you have static gk and everything and all these things are part of wbc's examination as well so this examination will be held tentatively in november and if you will have your uh, wbc's 2018 examination in january or february 2018 so if you appear for this examination, if you prepare well for this examination, then you will be prepared for WBCS 2018 as well. So this is a this is a good chance for you to actually to judge yourself how would be your performance by the end of this year. So I request you to submit this form and appear for this examination even if you are not prepared. Okay, so 150 marks of general studies, then you have 50 marks of arithmetic. So the people who are from science background, they don't have any problem with this 50 marks, but people who are not from science background, they need to learn arithmetic, they need to practice arithmetic, so that they perform well in this section. Okay, so once you clear this preliminary examination, now the seat is only 50, how much should be your target? In uh, I'll give you one statistics. In WBCS preliminary examination, more than two lakh aspirants write examination every year. Okay, so out of that, around five thousand, even less than that. This year, <coughs> little bit higher, but around five thousand they will select from the main exam from the preliminary, and they will be appearing for the main examination. So the, if you do the ratio, you can understand five thousand by. 2 lakhs by 2 5 zeros 3 4 5 out of the 3 zeros will be cancelled so 5 by 200 so only 2.5 percent will be selected from the preliminary examination now in WCS they have uh, vacancies around 500 so more vacancies are there but here vacancies are less so you can say it would be they can select as per my guess they can select not more than 1500 in the preliminary examination because only 50 vacancies so hardly 1500 or even less than that 1000 will be selected in preliminary examination so this is going to be tougher than wc's preliminary examination okay so for that you have to prepare well so i guess if you target for 5% to 70% in the preliminary examination, you will clear the examination. That means 75% 70% means your total 200 marks, that is 140. So you have to score between 130 to 140 in order to clear the examination tentatively. Okay. So if you clear this examination, then you have main examination. Now you, in main, what you have? You have conventional type. Paper one is English. Or and paper 2 is Bengali, Urdu, Nepali, Santali for uh, South Bengal people uh, mostly they will take Bengali. So in WBCS also you have two papers, one is English, one is Bengali. Here also you have two conventional papers, English and Bengali. So if you clear this preliminary examination and if you appear for the main examination then you will sense the play, uh, actually essence of the WBCS main examination before appearing for the actual WBC main examination and then general studies and arithmetic full marks you have uh, papers 1 and 2 will be 150 having a duration of 1 hour and 30 minutes ok ok sorry uh, so the paper 1 is English paper 2 is Bengali paper 3 is your general studies you can see here this is the paper 3 general studies and arithmetic full marks in each paper 
paper 1 and paper 2 will be 150 having duration of 1 hour 30 minutes 150 150 300 marks full marks for the paper 3 will be 150 so total 450 marks okay out of that 100 marks for general study and 50 marks for arithmetic that's a good thing if in arithmetic you have 50 marks and in GES you have 100 marks and the total time being 2 hours 30 minutes for this examination for this paper 3 examination and answers for group A portion should be given in English or in Bengali or in Nepali so you can opt for any language you want but mostly people write in English and you also try to write in English because I'll Afterwards, you have to communicate in English and if you do not know English, then you will face problem in later part of your life. So, I always suggest you to prepare in English even if you are from Bengali medium or some other regional background. Okay, so once you clear all this main examination, then you appear for interview and it contains 100 marks and based on preliminary main and interview, you will be selected. Okay, now I come to the individual syllabus. In paper 1 you have English, in that you have to draft a report which is there in WBCs as well. So, if you prepare it, you will be preparing for WBCs. Then translation from Bengali to English, it is also there in WBCs. Then your uh, prose passes, summary, phrases, phrases are there in WBCs. Then correct use of words, synonyms, antonyms, phrases is not there in WBCL, but that will make your English stronger. So, you appear for this examination. Then in paper 2, you have Bengali, in Bengali drafting report, which is there also in WBCS translation from English to Bengali, it is also there in WBCS. Then prose and passage, condensing. Uh, it is there in WBCS and grammar it is not there in WBCS but you have to prepare for it this is a bit tough because you forget you by the time you forgot everything so you have to again study Bengali grammar this is a huge challenge ok so those were all about the, uh, this special equipment examination so all my viewers, I would request you to appear for this examination and uh, if you have any queries, you can write me and I will be guiding you for this examination. We will do it together and uh, uh, my channel is like a discussion forum. I am not like your teacher but I am your support, I am your friend so please subscribe to my channel and uh, write in the comment section you can write in my mail id also and i'll be happy to reply to your email so let us have a good discussion forum so that all the people will be benefited out of it thank you very much